the Lord. Yes, we we read from uh, Genesis chapter 3 and we started at verse 16 and we went to verse uh, 24 and then we picked up at Genesis chapter 4. We started at verse 1 and I will be reading from verse 11 to 15 it says and now art thou cursed from the earth which art open her mouth to receive thy brother's blood from thy hand when thou tillest the ground it shall not henceforth healed unto thee her strength a fugitive and a vagabond shall thou be in the earth. And Cain said unto the Lord, My punishment is greater than I can bear. Behold, thou art driven me out this day from the face of the earth. 
and from thy face shall I be hid, and I shall be a fugitive and a vagabond in the earth. And it shall come to pass that every man that findeth me shall slay me. And the Lord said unto him, Therefore, whosoever slayeth Cain, vengeance shall be taken on him sevenfold. And the Lord set a mark up on Cain, lest any find him should kill him. Have mercy. And I tell you, um, it, th these we may have read over and over, but each time when we read about Cain and Abel, it, it, it still has that profound, at least to me, that profound impact to let us know that that was the beginning of the world. Cain, uh, was Cain the first or the second born of Adam and Eve? All right, no one wants to answer, but he was the first born. And uh, all the way back then, they had to offer sacrifices. Why? Was sacrifices required? Because of sin. Because of sin. And I, I'm very thankful that Jesus Christ came and offered up his life once and for all for us. So like how it was requested of Cain and Abel to offer sacrifices for their sins, but for some reason... Cain, do we believe that Cain could have asked Abel for a lamb or even buy a lamb or trade a lamb for some fruit? And it is this. Well, I, and, and the other thing I thought is that he feels like God should respect what he does. And, and and but but if but if we know what you know it says without the shedding of blood there is what no remission of sin and you can you can you get blood out of fruits no no you have to kill an animal and that's why Jesus Christ died because he had blood in him, and his blood was shed for us. So was Cain happy to see that God accepted Abel's sacrifice and rejected his? He was angry. He was angry. He was upset. And I tell people, I say, try not to be too upset. Because he was so upset that he did what to his brother Abel? He killed him. He killed him. And did he try to cover it up? Yeah. Yes, he tried to cover it up. And God has a good way to come and ask us questions when he already... Did God know what happened before he asked Cain what happened? Absolutely. <laughs> As a matter of fact, do we still believe that God knows what we do today before he come to us and say, why did you do that? He's an all-seeing God. He's an all-seeing God. We, cannot, we might as well just come and be up front with him. And that's why God said, Cain, your brother's blood cries out. And the other thing that we have to pay attention to is that did God punish Adam and Eve for what they did by eating of the tree of the knowledge of good and evil? Yes. 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 
he punished them. And, uh, you know, sometimes we may wonder why we sweat so much when we are working as men and even women. It's because of sin. Work was supposed to be enjoyable. He did not say we weren't going to work because he told them to, to, to keep and dress the garden. And that is work. But we, we were not supposed to be sweating so much. And as for women, I mean, when you are given birth, have mercy. Woo! I don't know, but was it painful? Or you were so happy to have that child that you didn't feel no pain? Sister Evans, help me out. I know you have children. All right. It was, it, it's supposed to. Yes, it, 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 it could be very painful, especially. You don't remember the pain. You don't remember the pain. Okay. <laughs> you don't remember the pain. Well, I, I mean, oh, wow. I, I understand because sometimes you're so happy to have that child that, you know, wow. But, you know, it's still painful. It's still painful. But it is all what happened because of sin. And, uh, you know, there is even worse to come for those who hold on to their sins. All I could say is that let us pray and ask God to help us that we may ask for forgiveness for our sins. We may repent of our sins so that God can bless us with eternal life. Let us not hold on to our sins. Let us ask for forgiveness. And if you don't get nothing out of it, we, re we see where Cain killed his brother. That, and, and that's part of, that's a sin. Because thou shalt not kill. Adam and Eve, they disobeyed God. That's the sin. And if we do the same, we will lose out on eternal life. Father God, just help us to ask you to forgive us of our sins so that when you come, we can go home with you. Praise ye the Lord.